But it was just this, like I mentioned, just this retention of emotion that I wasn't feeling in my body. And it was causing me a lot of stress, a bunch of anxiety. And I had these like thoughts before leading up to that being like, do I even love bodybuilding anymore? Do I like want to do this forever? Like this causes me so much like stress. It's so difficult. I'm already so successful in business and my following and your guys support. I know you'll still be there whether or not I'm competing. Like, am I still doing this for me for the right reason? Do I still love this? And that was scared me a lot. Like, I know I love bodybuilding. Thinking that that love might be fading put a lot of fear in my heart and anxiety and I wasn't feeling that either. You're not gonna feel like you love it all the time. You're just not. There's gonna be moments where you hate it, where you feel like you wanna quit, where you don't wanna do it anymore. And I want you guys to know that if there's something you guys are chasing and you have moments where you wanna quit, you really need to look deep inside you and think, and do you still love what you're doing at the time to quit? Or is it time to fucking double down and push through? Because getting through that moment made me so much stronger. And it made me really believe in myself so much more and be like, holy shit, but it's those moments that you push through that make you into something special, into something great, and get you to places where people normally don't get. Because the average person quits right then. Come on, Chris. Come on. It's like, I'm hard as fuck. I can get through fucking anything. Let's get to work. All your energy, I'm right here. Come on, let's go. Everything. <laughs> The true fucking measure of success is just belief in yourself. It's not passion, it's not motivation, it's not like, oh, how do you stay motivated? Just believing in yourself no matter what, having absolutely no fucking quit. Like I said in one of my old Instagram captions, champion mentality simply means that you have no quit. That's it. I don't give a fuck what it is, whatever your end goal is, you're willing to do absolutely anything to achieve that goal. There's no one I'm like trying to beat. There's no one I'm chasing. There's no one I'm like, I have to beat that guy. No, it's literally just me. I have to be better than me. 
Be 100%, be 110% of who you think you can be. Achieve your goals, fucking chase that shit, and be rewarded in the end. Be with happiness and success, growth. It's all possible. It just comes from having no quit. And like I said, believing in yourself no matter what. And I'm ready to absolutely suffer. Could fucking just eat nothing, do five hours of cardio, whatever I need to do. Get another! Push! Good, come on, come on, keep it going. Back it hard now, go, go. Just like that. Come on, buddy. let's go. Again, come on. Come on! Again! Finish. Good. Hard. Again, come on. shit done you push through it so to everyone out there whose dreams are scaring you who dreams make you want to quit just don't quit that's good your dreams should be big they should be scary just keep pushing through i have this thing i say champion mentality it's not about winning it's not about a trophy it's about having no quit it's about giving everything you have so that when you show up on game day before the results are over you're proud of yourself and you know the work you put in and that's all i can feel right now just pride and gratitude to be here on this stage under these lights again this, this will never get old, and I'm just so grateful to have the opportunity to do what I love. Here's your two-time ring defending Classic Physique Olympia champion, Chris Bumstead.